It's just shit connection then. Literally nothing to do with the person <laughs> operating it. Okay, okay, other than it being okay, okay. Got, I get it, I get it. We are back with Digital Blackface. Welcome, guys, to episode 26. Um, Today is actually a week earlier than we were supposed to start. And if you're here, you definitely know the reason why we started early, specifically today. Um, I'm here with my co-host, Lamb. Lamb, say hi, please. Howdy, howdy. Uh, I'm also here with Baku. Hey, people. And 100% the reason most of you are here, Dankula himself. Bonjour. Bonjour. So, you, you all know why we're here. Um, I woke up around like 10, 10, 11 today. Like, I mean, 10, 11 in the morning. And around 10, 36, I got a DM from someone. Uh, one of this uh, Discord's very own moderators. And she told me something that woke me up immediately before my shower, before I ate breakfast, before everything. Chris Chan fucked her mother. Baku. Surprise, motherfuckers. <laughs> just, gonna, just gonna let that sink in for everyone. Chris Chan. Yes. It's just like, this this is the internet's nine eleven. Like this this is one of the worst things that has ever happened on the fucking internet, honestly. I I usually wouldn't agree with such a, a hard sentiment, but you know what? I kinda have to here. Holy fuck. Where was, were you when it happened? Yeah, where where were you when Chris Chan fucked his mum? I mean look. <laughs> like, honestly. Chris like, Chan. Never never forget. It was a fucking mess. It was just a fuck. It was just okay. Look, it is saw, still a fucking mess. Okay, look. When I saw it, I was like, "No, this can't be true. This has to be edited. This has to be fake." Like, have you guys heard the audio? Yes. No. Yeah. Lam I can't. Lam <laughs> Lam haven't heard yeah. Don't. Audio. Don't. Don't. Okay. Lam, Lam, don't. Don't. I'm a sensitive soul. I can't handle it. Okay. Okay. Lam, because here's the thing. Here's the thing. After a little bit, I was gonna play some of the audio for people to hear it. You think you can handle that, Lamb? Uh, I can probably handle it enough, yeah. Okay, we'll, we'll give it like oh, a, minute, a minute and a half. A minute and a half for you to just take oh, it in. That's so long to be in hell. <laughs> it's, it's nine minutes, this, 30 seconds, by the way. This is what hell feels like. <laughs> but, okay, everything altogether. The internet the internet has lost, lost its mind. This outtrended the Olympics. Today, <laughs> Chris Chan was international. He outtrended the Olympics on Twitter. He's even trending in Mr. China, I've heard. Right. Fucking China. UK, China. I, can you imagine if Prince England, I mean, Prince England, Prince Philip. Which, Prince England. I don't know. Okay, there's an Arthur and a Philip, right? Is it? There's well, Prince, 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 Prince Philip. Prince, Prince Philip, Philip and right, Prince okay. Charles, and who's the other one? Harry, that's it, Harry. Um, yeah. Anyway, um, Harry Osborne. I mean... Harry Osborne, Harry, okay. Harry England. You know what? Uh, what's his name? I'm sorry. I I am a little bit high. Oh, just a little bit. Anyway, a little. <laughs> Didn't come prepared as usual. No, no. Stop. Stop. My stop, man. Stop. Um. Can you imagine Prince Philip knowing about Chris Chan? That internet boy fucked his mummy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Jesus. Um. I just Kill can't Popoli. believe it. I can't believe it. It's, and it's, it's, been, it's been getting so much worse. So See the fact worse. that it's traded in China. The fact that it's traded in China and China so closely monitors the fucking internet. That means there's a high chance that Xi Jinping even knows that Chris Chan fucked his mom. <laughs> I think I think the the best part of that for them is that it just demoralizes America even more. Yeah. Good does. God. We have a new shame to carry. They're yes. sitting there now doubling down on their intent to destroy the West. <laughs> They're like, well, this just this just proves oh it. Oh my God. Oh my. <laughs> oh. Okay. Ugh. And and the worst part, like, there are, there are there are a few theories. There are a few theories, by the way, and this was something that I was speculating on earlier right now. I know that there's an audio recording and all these other things, but one thing to be aware of as well is, like, everyone knows Chris Chan is severely mentally ill. Like, heroically fucking mentally ill. Like, Terry, Terry A. Davis doesn't even have shit on Chris <laughs> Chan. Right, because Chris Chan's made an entire fucking universe in his head. 
right? That has characters and ca character and arcs and settings and stories and all this shit, right? And, and but... that, that mentally illness is well documented. Yes, very well he's, documented. He's but... one of the most well documented people on the world. No, no, no oh, I, yeah. I tweeted about since, this. Since, two, since 2007. Since 2007, yeah. like, we will lose history. so much history, and people will still know who Christian is. People will still know yeah. who Christian is when I don't know, like no one even knows about Trump. Well, that's, that's... the thing to remember, though, is Christian has been manipulated in the past to believe things that aren't true and incorporate fake things into his own life and into his little Sonichu universe that he has in his head. So see, at the start of this, I thought, right, because there was these guys called the Try Guys or the Idea Guys who were a group of trolls that were fucking with Chris Chan and making him making him do shit. And basically the, the stuff that they were doing, this was like felonies, like Josh from Kiwi Farms, like Josh and everyone oh my God. from Kiwi Farms like, like got Jesus involved. Jesus Christ. And like the, well. he, like, not like the FBI, like Josh actually submitted to a report to the FBI because he was like, this isn't trolling, this is like sheer fucking crime. Like they were blackmailing Chris for money and Chris paid like thousands of dollars to these guys. And yeah, it was some fucked up shit. But these guys knew how to manipulate Chris into thinking shit was real. And they, like I, I interviewed Chris on my channel and just out of fucking nowhere, and you can find the clip, it's out there. I've still got the interview up my channel. Chris says that ted bundy is part of the sonichu universe i and remember, ted oh, yeah. Bund I remember bundy. that yeah Chew. yeah yeah and oh. he, he was also part part sonichu as well and that ted bundy was framed and an innocent man and you just sort of see me go what like, like on it right so that's how a part of me went is this real or is this another one of these fake things that someone has implanted in his head and when i first heard it i thought right i think this is just one of Chris's delusions, but the more and more that the day has gone on, and the fact that the cops have went to Chris's house now, has they've taken his mother away and put her into some senior home where she's getting a wellness check, and I think Chris himself has been sectioned, which is basically like put in like a mental housing unit. Yeah, or something. he's been, he's been is, removed is, from his home. Yeah, yeah, that's making me sort of go, oh no. Oh, no, like yeah. it's it's no longer delusion, and it's crossing the line of either he really did it on his own, or he was coerced into doing it, which is even worse. Yes, yes. I, he has been coerced to do some really heinous things already. Shout out to uh, GameStop. I mean that he didn't need no co coercing for that. He did that all on his own. Um, but uh, just some of the other things that he's done through, I mean, even Blue Spike era and upwards. Um, oh, apparently there she's is... in geriatric care in the hospital, not a nursing home. Right. Uh, Jesus. Um, but there is probably someone else that shares some blame in this, almost surely. But I did say to some others before this started that... Uh, just because an aggressive dog is aggressive because somebody beat it doesn't mean the dog is not aggressive and needs to be treated as such. Chris Chan is a danger to the public at this stage. Yeah. No matter whose fault it is, he still needs to be treated uh, with... Accordingly. Yeah, with some kind of care, some special care. Look, you... He'll get fucking annihilated if he goes to prison for this. They will not send him to prison. Uh, They'll put him in a mental ward first. Yeah. Yeah, probably. Like, probably a high-security mental ward. Like, we're not talking they get day trips or anything like that, but... I don't know, I don't know why. I just got this entire fucking, like, sketch in my head. Of all these guys in the mental ward, these are guys that like used to like fucking eat people, and one guy wore a woman's skin as a fucking dress, and like all this shit. And then at the end of the hall, it's just Chris walking down from his like. Oh. Oh, Ultra. Oh wait, did the dink? He's just <laughs> yeah. Two mask on. Yeah, he's getting wheeled down with a mask on like fucking Hannibal Lecter because motherfucker thinks he's Sonic. <laughs> Look, <laughs> honestly, there's actually one thing I was talking with Baku about this earlier. Can you imagine if Chris went to prison and came out like he's 39 right now? What if he went to prison yeah. and came out like just jacked, like completely? I'm on, ripped? I'm on the opposite boat, unfortunately, of prison bitch. 
which I hate the thought of, but it's the most likely possibility. He is... Yeah. He, yeah. Chris Chan considers themselves a woman. Uh, how that's going to go over in prison uh, if I, prison was the option? I, I, I can tell. I can <laughs> tell. I can tell you how it's going to go down. I, I can tell you exactly what happens to trans people in prison. They get passed around like a fucking joint. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yep. Like a joint. Yeah, like I said, prison bitch or nothing. Yeah. As, as much as I hate safe, to say that, then. you're like safe as the prison bitch. But like. Is mm. oh that's God. not that's not exactly guaranteed. A oh and B. That's still a very very bad thing. Like let's not get that wrong. I don't like that. After everything that's been you know that's happened to Chris, because of all the trolling, all this and that, and all the mental illness on top of that, Chris ends up in prison. Uses a prison bitch. That's the fucking worst. This really is Internet 911. Holy shit. Yeah, so you'd imagine him sitting there. To t- Explaining solitude is some fucking. Okay, no, that's, that's kind of funny. Actually. That that would be hilarious. I'm not gonna lie. That would actually, be that thought is out hilarious. Out of the sky, just hilarious. Casually explaining solitude to the other prisoners. That's that's kind of. I funny. think we are looking at the end of his entire era, though. Uh, speaking plainly, just because I, no matter where so. he go, okay, but no matter where he goes, right? Like he is going to have a hard time actually being able to have a camera anywhere he goes. Well, that's the thing. It's not. It's not about that. The thing I'm saying is, let's wait for the court arc. Yeah. Well, I okay. Because that's got to be a thing, and that media circus is going to be awful. Oh, so I guess it's the beginning of the end, is what I'd like to say. Yeah. Yeah, and I, I don't think that there's a chance he might come back because, like, you know, whenever a YouTuber gets caught in some like absolutely horrendous drama, they usually just vanish and disappear from the internet, and that's. That they they ride off into the sunset and that's the last anyone hears from them. But, that's uh, still on Fortnite, gay. What yeah, happened to that British guy with glasses? Yeah. Like the blonde <laughs> British guy with glasses. <laughs> Which one? Um, the one with the accent. Um, 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 no, the, the, oh yeah, the one with the accent in Britain. <laughs> that, that, that that narrows it right. Long time. <laughs> do you mean do you mean do you mean many lads? Y- yes, him. Yeah, yeah many lads. Uh, he's he's gone. He's, oh, he's away. Like I, I, yeah. I remember the, the last time I saw him, he was like in a, a Soro suit house video. I don't I don't know what things are right now. Um. Anyway, but Mini Lad just vanished. I'm like, wait, what did he actually do? And I still don't know. But apparently, it was bad enough for him to just poof. What Mini Lad? I. He was a uh, messaging oh, uh, underagers. So oh, another yeah, James okay. Charles slash Jake Bell situation. Yeah, except uh, James Drake, Charles somehow got away with it. Drake did. Drake. I mean, Drake actually did stuff. Um, James did James Charles do stuff? Like I know he was un. I'm Drake, sorry. Uh, Drake did, did plead what? guilty. Yeah. Um, yeah, Drake. He pleaded guilty. He was actually. He's. Yeah. He, people have reported him. The charges were of his like ex girlfriend saying. Uh, he sexually assaulted her friend when they were like 15 and including her. Jesus. Yeah. Drake is full on. There was a, I, I, every time someone, that gets mentioned to me, I keep remembering the one guy on YouTube who made a video where it was like Drake and Josh, but it's the court, it's the court video of Drake Bell pleading guilty with laugh tracks and all. Yeah, I watched that. I watched that when I was on vacation and it was hilarious. Also, people are saying that this. You, you calling me a child in danger? People are saying my volume is still down. Like I'm like right next to the mic, and like I removed all the limiters and fine. filters. Apparently, they can't hear me, which is weird. Anyway, uh, so I explained this to Lamb just two hours ago. Lamb, can you tell me like, like the the thought process you went through when when I when I told this to you? I don't appreciate how you want me to relive trauma on live <laughs> for the enjoyment of others. I feel like I'm being used, I mean, but look, because because I'm already here. Thank you. I, I guess I'll go it. ahead and go ahead and be a victim. Uh, oh, hold on. Shut up. <laughs> I'm, I'm laughing too much. I apologize, everyone. Look, my gain is okay. I'll turn up my gain even higher, but like it's like seriously loud. Anyway. Um, so it's, it's I like said, because uh, the man asked me, he says, do you want to do a podcast? And I said, well, you know how I feel about giving me a 
a couple of days in advance because, you know, I don't like things just sprung on me. The man then says, Chris Chan fucked his mom. And I said, no, he didn't. Shut up. Shut up. Yeah, I did do that. I did <laughs> and, do that. Uh, and continue to ask for evidence because I'm not on Twitter currently, but I almost just about hopped back on and started mad tweeting like uh, no other. Yeah, I've been mad tweeting all day too. I understand. I've been through this. I am legitimately shooketh because it's not like I, I didn't not see something kind of like this coming, but for it to actually manifest is something very different altogether. And it's kind of surreal in a state where a man feels just shock like when i'm like oh this is this is the, the final arc has begun and then i'm like this is really disgusting and sad and i don't even know how to fucking no. deal with myself maybe i'll like take a shot apparently shower. apparently there was... like if, if, sorry go ahead if, if, if someone asked me a week ago right oh what's what's the most mental thing that chris chan and could do it. and when you when you know all the lore and you know everything that has happened over the years you would just be kind of like I have, I have no fucking idea. There's, there's videos of him fucking shitting on the floor. There's videos, several videos of him. There's, I mean, there's literally a video of him fucking a blow up doll, doggy style, while singing fucking all star. There's also like, one of his, There's also one of him spinning it on his dick badly yeah. too. Absolute mad yeah. lad. Yeah, like so. That's why that would make me go. There's, there's no, there's, there's, this is a plateau now. There is nowhere that he can go from here. Motherfucker fucks his own I, mom like no. I hate to break it to you. I hate to break it to you, but Christian lore is uh just like what everyone thinks Bitcoin is, uh to the fucking moon. No, no, here's the thing. Like <laughs> people were mentioning how like it was today. I knew I've known about Chris Chan for a while because you can't really be deep into the internet and not know about Chris Chan at all. Anyway, someone I found out today that Chris Chan has talked about having a thing for his mother for a while like he's even though there was a video last year of him humping a pillow while threatening her good god i've never seen this video and i don't want to there was even a clip years ago like someone just said it right now a clip years ago of christian saying that he is fine with incest but would never personally partake in it right because you know that people have their limits, of course. Except he didn't really have that limit. He was just saying it. Oh God, this is a day. This is a day. This is this is dead. Yeah, this this has been interesting. Like I like I said earlier, like I I had a day off today. I was looking forward to it. First day off I've had in like two months since building the studio. Sat in front of my computer, to play games. And then one of my friends just messaged me and said. Chris Chan fucked his mother. Every everyone is getting is getting this news from a friend, except for those on Twitter who got it from me, and that was that was fun. I just I just want to say straight up right now, we we all kind of knew that the Chris Chan saga would be sort of like a Greek tragedy. I just didn't think it'd be fucking Oedipus Rex. Oedipus Rex. Yeah. Or like Oedipus Rex. I thought that this lol cow, cow was dry. I really did. I thought there was nothing to we, milk. We'd there already was nothing seen to milk. this. No I, I thought what I, I thought what was going to happen is shit was just going to like trundle on for a little while with the occasional you know weird thing happening, and then Barb would die, and then what would happen is Chris would get taken into care. See, he that's what get, I yeah. was waiting what to I happen. Thought. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And that 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 could have still been fun. I mean, not Barb dying, but you know, like maybe him <laughs> going to a home and then having a can in the home and causing shenanigans that would have been my optimum not this and yeah it's like, like, just, I, I like like forever a lol cow just forever a lol cow i just ugh. this isn't lol cow anymore though. i mean no before like, you could have said if it, it was like already that. sad it was already sad to watch because like sometimes you do feel bad for him because you know that he's been led but other times you know he's done it to it's himself just no, yeah, this look, is yeah. this is maximum pain. It, it is terrible. It was after it was after Liquid Chris. Wait, what, what, what's, got, what's Liquid Chris? What's Liquid Chris? A, a guy, a guy, a guy literally like bought the exact same like the famous polo shirt that Chris always wears and made his own sauna tube medallion. Oh no! And like made videos, pretended to be Chris and saying, "I I am the real creator of sauna tube." This. 
other Chris Chan person as an imposter, and then the original Chris got really angry about it, and everything oh, like this new no. guy got called li 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 Liquid Chris. <laughs> so, oh no! And then it was is... it was Solid Chris versus Liquid Chris. Good God! Oh, and that, also... that was funny. No, continue, continue. That was funny, but everything after that is when shit just started going like really fucking downhill. Yeah, I I go back and see some more. Of probably this. one of the funniest. Man. Wait, did you guys? Okay, the good old days. Okay, um, Baku, you remember you remember the video, yes. right? The the audio of of what? Crit, he Unfortunately, was yes. Okay, can you name some of your favorite quotes? No, I'd rather not. Okay, let me. I'm I'm going to name my favorite quote. Okay. I don't believe Mr. C ever reached her G-spot. He's talking about his dad, by the way. He's talking about NTR and his dead father. The NTR and okay, I'm not gonna he's lie, the NTR and his dead father actually killed me. Using, he's literally using, like he literally, the way he referred to it, all I couldn't help but think was like some like, um, some, some dude detailing some sort of fantasy with their mother. And the fact that it happened for real is just the worst part. And like he like the way he talks about his mother is exactly the way I've seen like I've been on Twitter for a bit, not as long as other people, but I've seen people who actually engage in zoophilia, and the way they talk about the animals is the same way he talked about his mother. Ooh, yeah, don't remind me about that. Nom, nom, nom. <laughs> Amy, what are you? Just, I, I don't even know. Amy just popped in. Hey, Amy. What's up, Amy? No, that's because you don't check anything that you should. Okay, Thank first... God I'm here. Thank you, Lamb. Uh, no, my uh, perms are fucked. I couldn't get in the channel anyways. Really? Uh, oh, I forgot to give you the role. I've got to. Give... That's my fault. Um, when you low key still the producer. <laughs> um, look, I am I one, of, one of the one of the worst things that I've seen. <laughs> but it was it was funny, but it was just. I it, can't it, believe he had oh. sex with his fucking mom. He raped her. Not even. There was a fucking response on the Kiwi Farms thread that literally says, Imagine Chris's dad looking down and seeing his fat retard son raping his ex wife. Even if the man's in heaven, he's still in hell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Chris Chan trended in Switzerland for nearly fucking. Almost all day. Are it's you still on trending. Me? No shots. It's still on trending. <laughs> oh, that is horrible. This in is Sweden, awful. Though, apparently. Did you hear the angry fucking German? <laughs> Amy, Amy, you do realize it's also trending in China, right? It's trending oh, everywhere. Oh my god. Yeah. Ugh, if if you're listening to this, Jinping, um, please uh, write in in chat what your favorite um Chris Chan saga was, arc, whatever. I want to know. I want. Yeah, I want to chat. What your, your favorite China? Arc. The immortal leader of China has Personally, to say. Personally, the art saga was my favorite. Wait, Bambi's not a female? Who? Excuse I mean, me? The, the deer, the cartoon deer, it's not a female? No, it's not. Boy. Why are you bringing this up right now? Because someone oh, mentioned fuck. it in, in, in chat. I'm like, I didn't know that. Uh, 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 what How is he? I hate you. What the fuck? I hate you. Thank you, Amy, for bringing us back. I'm sorry about that. Um, uh, this yeah, is... everyone, everyone in here now has a very good reason to go catch up on the Chris lore. Holy shit! Like I'm actually look, I haven't actually watched a single video. I have just learned of Chris Chan through osmosis. Oh, I've been. Like, I've I kept shared up for a little, little bit. With, I've shared videos of him without knowing ah, who jingle, he was. Jingle, jingle. Why There's Chris one. There's one really, really good documentary which I think covers everything up until 2017. I, it was a film student that made it for his fucking, like his fucking <laughs> film thesis, and like, and the, he passed. But he, he's, he's like, his lecturer, like afterwards, was like, yeah, I don't know what the fuck Can that was, but it was well. But I never want to hear that. Yeah. 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 That's like the original Chris Chan documentary. Yeah, that, that, yeah, that's that's the original. That for a lot of people that were like Zoomers and stuff like that, that was their first ever experience of Chris Chan. For those that weren't around since two thousand and seven, that's when his first video appeared of him like reading his little bit of paper with his little polo on, going, "My name is Christian Weston Chandler." That but was he was filmed before that. Really? Oh yeah, that was he when was he, he when won... he was a kid when he won that yes. thing with Sega. Yeah. Yeah, I was. I know it was Pokemon. I just he drew names Pokemon. out of a yeah. hat. I just won. Wait, imagine, imagine his life if he hadn't won that. 
You think he would have been less obsessed with? No, 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 no. That footage was only uncovered later, but it is yeah. uh, theorized yeah. that that him winning that as a kid and then kind of getting that sense of entitlement later fueled his. Oh no. What, what originally what originally caused it was basically he had a little remember like way back in the internet days there was these websites that done build your own website like shit like type thing right and the, he, he made Angel his own fire. little yeah he made uh, yeah it was something like that and he made his own little crappy website and uploaded his sonitude stuff to it right and then someone don't know how managed to find this little random site with the sonitude stuff in the sonitude universe and he posted it on 4chan and that drove a lot more traffic to chris chan's site oh and people God. were laughing at him and on him and everything at first everyone thought it was a joke chris chan then uploaded that infamous video of himself his first ever internet video onto the website and that's when like everyone in, that was just that was just dumping a big bucket of blood in a water full of sharks like honestly like then that's what started it everyone started dunking on chris chan i think that was in 2007 i believe honestly i think that that's when it all first started feels like the wild west days of internet this is so deep yeah. I, I am learning so much oh, can, we... can we get a fucking like federal oh, holiday for christmas i'm just about to say channel 11 is uh july 30th now i think we're oh about to God. get some federal ch charges <laughs> 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 this is gonna be i just can't imagine like good oh, god the this funny is thing, <clears> this is still like this is that movie bob will never be as bad as chris chan <laughs> yeah actually don't tempt fate. What could he, what could movie actually Bob no? Do? Yeah, that's right. Wait a minute. Movie Bob do? Movie Bob short fucks of, his mom. What could no, movie Bob do? Short, I don't know. Short, look, fucks his short dad. of kidnapping Lindsay yeah. Ellis I, and I, living I, out I, some. I, look, I, listen, listen. Uh, the only thing uh, talking, uh, movie Bob could do to beat this would be to kidnap <laughs> Lindsay Ellis and build some sort of fake life for them somewhere out in I don't know the Appalachian Mountains or something. I, th I think for movie Bob, the one that definitely is within the realm of possibility is he goes on a mass shooting at CPAC. Oh, Jesus. I, 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 like, I, I realize I say that like half as a joke, but also half oh, thinking I actually Christian think he would do that. You know, I can't even blame you for either of those. Also, to answer someone, no, Vosh will not be worse than CUWC, though. And I'm saying that not out of I don't think it'll happen, as more as a I don't want to jinx it. Look, I don't think there's anything we could really say. No one believes this would Fuck actually happen. This, this, is, this is the what moment. Is it? I remember someone, I don't, sort of I don't know if it was, was Mudahar or you. But like, okay, in, in the span of two days, look at what's happened. Like, we have the one Fortnite guy who got arrested on diddling kids. The, uh, we the have Brazilian this. Guy. Was he Brazilian? That makes a lot more yeah, sense. Yeah, he was actually. in Brazil, yeah. Yeah. Yikes! Okay, I'm Hispanic. It. Come on, it's fine. <laughs> We're to make. Uh, what, 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 there was another thing that happened. There was another thing that happened. There was another big thing. I can't remember though. What, what was the big thing that happened? Christian. Wait, no, no. Isn't there a concert where Vosh is like into horse cocks or something? Like I was gonna real say, you <laughs> hello, for kettle. I think. <laughs> I mean, no, 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 no. Amy, Amy, Amy is, Amy is open with it. She, we accept her for it. It's part of her. I mean, in a way, it might be part of her. She comes how as deep is. In there. But oh, yeah. Thank you. Act Activision Blizzard as well. That, oh, yeah, that was also Activision the third Blizzard one. Thing. Thank you. Okay, the Cosby like, room. The Cosby room thing. I, I admit, like, like I posted a tweet about the Cosby room. <laughs> what the fuck? The Cosby Shrine. The in, in the last three days, the wrong, the wrong kind of people have been porked. Holy fuck! Oh my god. <laughs> the funny thing was watching all the employees walk out to protest their own actions. Oh my god. Honestly, he got his boyfriend free girls. Recently, like this, this isn't even good. This isn't even drama. like this is all just this is horrible. <laughs> this is just fucking like, disgusting the, shit. It was it was funny for like the first five seconds of laughing at Activision Blizzard having a reason to go. Okay, you know. Well, finally they'll go down. Then you hear about the Fortnite guy, you're like, alright, well, you know, obvious. Then you hear this and you just say, okay, I, I think it's over. I'm done for the day. I'm done for the week. I'm done for the rest of my fucking life. I cannot read Chinese, and I don't think I want to read that. <laughs> oh my god. And people are still finding it out. Jesus Christ. There's, yeah, they're day. still getting information on it.
That's the sad thing. It's not even like oh, we don't have all the info yet. Hey, question. Would I've you guys want me to talk to Bosch on the podcast? Would you like me like to just like talk to him? That would just... be awful. No. Okay. No, thank uh... you. Yeah, okay, see, Some on, on the pro questions. side, on the pro side, it'd be funny to, like, have at least one person on the podcast fucking yell at him for a stupid take. But I, no, because it's Vosh, please do not. I just want to talk to him. I think we could be, I think we'd be, we could be drinking buddies. I think we could drink together. I, I just want to like talk. I just want to talk. I just want to shoot him. I just want to talk. <laughs> no, I'm not saying I, I want to talk like I want to talk. I just want to actually talk to him to, like, understand how but he Vosh. is as a person. But Vosh. Don't you know? Or yeah, I dig with Vosh, Discord really. Yeah, Vosh. Is the same as uh, child labor, therefore pedophile should be illegal. I've I've done I've done a debate with Vosh before, and he How didn't do it? well. How was uh, it? He didn't do well. The, the the subject of the debate was, "Am I a white supremacist?" Oh, oh yeah, that's, that's fun. People, and then the funny a, thing is, a people don't seem to understand what that word means, or they seem to think that anything they want to claim as white supremacist can be used Wait. for it. I thought it's you. Wait a minute. Speaking of Osh, he tried to debate someone and he started out his debate request by calling him a, calling him a fat cunt. So he declined to debate him because he started it out with an ad hominem. <laughs> like, debate me, bro. Debate me. <laughs> oh my god. Have you guys seen the, uh, the okay, Wojaks about me, Chris bro. Chan today? Unfortunately. Uh... <laughs> who wants to eat my bar bussy? Oh no! Who wants to get their bar bussy ate? Omg me! <laughs> Cease this! Holy shit! Oh, that, funny that thing! Someone just said right there. Killer. Someone just said right there. I just want to talk to him in the language in which I am most fluent with bullets. I actually went shooting last week, and granted it was airsoft, but I want a hundred of them. All I'm going to say is there is one good thing to come out of this. There is only one that I can think of at the moment, what and that's we ruined incest porn for at least a, a couple hundred thousand people. I think if only this, if this spreads enough. Incest porn? What the fuck? If this spreads enough, we might ruin it for a whole generation. <laughs> Let's go. Y'all niggas are fucking looking at incest porn. Hello. I mean, look, if it's good enough no, for Ted we... Cruz, it's good enough for me. No, stop. <laughs> that's what I said. Was that too much? You know we. We, we should stop calling him a motherfucker. I think he takes it a little too literally. Oh. Despite the fact that you have a girlfriend, you are the most suspect person I know. Who, oh, me? Yes, I know. No, Poe. Oh, yeah, that's fair. Wait, what did I do? What did I do? Everything. Okay, but nah. specifically, like, right now. Okay. I mean, you asked if you want to get Vosh in here. I mean, yeah, I can talk to Vosh. But... It's an automatic, Al. Podcast dead. <laughs> I I, th I think the podcast might actually just devolve no into podcast. fighting, and both in the comments and in the podcast. If if I talk to Vosh, it would just be the wrong sorts of people mixing. Yeah. Thank God, I have I have a question for you here, buddy. Uh, after after all this, you know, all the Chris Chan shit you've seen, out of the three things that have happened in the last two days, which is like, which is the most longest impacting one? Do you think? Longest impact and um, it's, it's definitely I think gonna, him it's definitely losing his virginity cast. is the longest. I mean, see, I get that's that what I was originally your thinking. Mother part, just he but lost like, his virginity. wait, didn't but he like, lose his virginity? Oh didn't he lose his virginity to a prostitute? Yeah, that is correct. That joke doesn't stick because he already did it earlier with a hooker. But like, the reason I say that is because you you know you'd think it's Chris Chan after all this shit, but Activision Blizzard actually is useful in society. People actually know who Activision Blizzard is outside of, you know, tards like us. Mm. Yeah, but, but like in, in terms of like the entire internet community, like Chris Chan has been on the scene for like a, a really fucking long time. Like that he's, is true. He's been around. Anyone that's been on 4chan or anything like from back in the day, like all the old schoolers know who fucking Chris Chan is. And this, this is going to send fucking shockwaves through the fucking community. Like, honestly, this this is going to be around for a fucking while. And a part of me, I'm still maybe about 50-50 on whether this is just a delusion that Chris has created in his head or if this did, in fact, happen. I, I really hope it's the former. Wait, because uh, at least that yeah, way, yeah, no yeah. one was hurt. Yeah, I don't I'm think really he's creative enough it. for that. That's That's some... Dark shit. But no, no Chris, I could no, see Chris, I could see Chris people Chan doing that to him though. No, no, Chris Chan has made up some fucked up stuff in his yeah. 
Yeah, like even he's created like a daughter for him for himself. Yeah, oh, crystal. crystal, crystal, yeah, yes. crystal, and all that shit. Let's, yeah, let's not forget yeah. Asanachu. Wait, yeah, also, yeah. D- Dank. Um, you said community. Is there actually like a Chris Chan community, or do you mean like the general internet community? No, there, there are there are people that, that in general internet community. Like if you've been if you've been in the game long enough, you know oh, who okay. Chris Chan is. But there is still a Chris Chan community because there's one guy that I told you about the guy that made like. Uh, the documentary that oh, documents yes, that like one. everything like real, real deep lore stuff he's got photos of his childhood and everything the guy worked with chris and his family to make that documentary but there's another guy who posts like a video every week and it's called christery like this week in christery like, and it's basically just posts like weekly updates on chris chan the guy's got about 56 videos so far like he just posts them all the time of all the updates <laughs> yeah gino samuel also does a full is doing like from beginning of chris chan era to the present i don't know how gino is going to do now because i don't know how much information is going to get uh changed and shaped and cut from places for chris chan's sake uh but that information should pro- is probably already mostly written down by him, but he is. I don't even know where he is in the era after Chris uh, became a woman. Anyway, is where we're at in that current documentary series. This is just this is the craziest thing to happen on Twitter in a while. This is just. Oh, dank. The question I was going to ask, I forgot it, but. Um... <clears throat> Baku, you remember what you were telling me about. Uh about Chris's Frick, I You're not allowed what? to get high before a podcast anymore. Jesus I'm Christ. sorry. Oh. I am sorry. My brain is heating oh. up. Fried. <laughs> Apologize immediately. <laughs> okay. I asked you something about it, but I forgot. Oh, wait. Yeah, I remember what I wanted to do. I wanted to play the video. That's what I wanted to do. That's what I was talking about. The we we took how long before we started oh, the playing audio. audio? It's been like 30 something minutes. Anyway. Jesus Christ. Quiet down. So, yeah, she's got really the G spot because apparently I don't believe her. I don't believe he's in Mr. C. Any of her past. Don't look in the podcast chat. They haven't really reached in her G spot really. Right. Right. They haven't. They had, they were more focused on. <laughs> Did Chantai? So, really, no. No. Her, which that's my focus. Yeah, we have to listen right? to it on YouTube. <laughs> Dude, yeah. True. Um, for like, but at the convention, make sure to have uh, a lot of fun. With, make sure to have a you know push her. And have a lot of fun with her, right? Because um. Obviously. Yeah, because now you're doing this for your mom. Yeah. Uh, make sure I'll be there. I'll be there yeah. watching you guys, making sure that nobody is trying to. <coughs> Sorry, my throat. <coughs> Nobody's trying to hurt you, do anything. I'll take photos of you too. So the dance would be awesome. We can take turns. I'd yeah. like to dance with her too, and then you guys can take like, the slow dance or whatever. Yeah. And uh. Among, and all the other uh, scientists. Yeah. Uh, Man. Right. Well. But how are, how are you feeling, Christine? How are you feeling? Because I know there's a lot of societal pressure oh, on no, you about, I'm like, um, this thing with Barbara. Um, excuse there's a lot of societal me. pressure, and a lot of people, you know, consciously, who judge, like, who would judge, I and, you know, there's a lot of eyes so on distraught. you. It must be very stressful. Because rightfully yeah, so. Yes. Yeah, I can imagine. I'm so sorry about all that stuff, yeah. Not. Well, still, but I'm still right. <laughs> this is beyond fuck. You always have them. I'm okay. The incest fanfics have come true and shit. I didn't even know there was such a thing. I didn't even know there was incest fanfics. Were there about you and Barbara? I can't believe that. I didn't even think that. I, I knew that you guys had a good relationship, but I always thought, because uh, I'm not huge on Christery and, you know, whatever. I just thought that the whole Sonatry franchise was very interesting, and that's how I um, got into you when I was younger, right? But I had I I didn't I had any idea that Barbara was um that Barbara knew I had that sort of relationship. I never got any of those uh, vibes. But um, how did you approach her? I approached her with care and caution. Mm-hmm. And it was a time, it was a time approach. So I just gave her comfort and talked with her, and we just branched out slow and steady, and then I. 
approached her positively, let her make the first move. She wanted to do it. And she oh, she did? Really? She made the first move? Yeah. Oh, oh really? Get to wow, Barbara. Oh, how, about how did she do it, if you don't mind me asking? Like, what uh, was the first how move? How files talk about animals? Uh, uh, I don't remember. Well, that was her first move, but my approach was... Oh, this, this hurts. Yeah, I forgot exactly what, what, termino what terminology and approach I used, but I approached the canary caution. That's good. And I was, and I was, most, and I was direct and upfront with her for the most part. That's good. And what, how did she respond when you um, when you approached her? What did she say? I don't, I don't remember exactly what she said, but it was kind of, it was, I think... She was partially confused at one point, but but then she came around, obviously, with the more approaching, with the more approaching that I was uh, doing with her along the way. Right. So she so she got into it. How was did you? How was the first kiss? You kissed her. How did that feel? Having known this woman for your whole life, how did that feel? Oh yeah, I mean it was simple. Uh, lip lip lock lip to lip kiss content, but yeah, it was actually good and it felt right. When did you start having feelings for Barbara? How much longer much I endure this? Obviously for yeah. yeah. Jesus. Well, for a long time, I mean, I remember even mentioning the baby ago, has had enough. Oh, please. Wait a minute, who is talking to Chris? We are you know? literally halfway through, that's, through that's the audio. Really? So, yeah. Oh yeah, God. but yeah, that's right. The Oedipus content. Oh, Oedipus, that's right. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Uh, how, how, if you don't mind me asking, I know that's probably personal, you have to answer, but how is the sex? Uh, I'd say it was satisfactory, it took a while, it took a few tries to... It took a few tries, yeah. Get, she is, she's older. older. And plus, uh, also, she's very understanding about the whole thing as well. I was direct with her, still direct and honest with her. And I made sure that I... Yeah, obviously, I'm never gonna propose marriage to her at all because we're always. Chat is literally losing their mind on YouTube right now. Yeah, mother and daughter. Make it stop. You know, they say there's no, there's no stronger bond than a mother and her daughter. Sorry. We've been doing it every third this night. This is goddamn awful, bro. Oh, what the fuck? Oh yeah, he's oh, like 39, 40, and his mom is 80. Yeah. Well, at least you have a stable, you have a stable relationship. Literally, double because double you know it's not gonna end. Like, I, if anything I, happened, you'd still be. You would still be, you know, you'd still be mother and daughter. You're, it's not gonna like be explosive breakup, right? That's at least that's comforting. Yeah. Yeah. So you said since <laughs> June, June. I'm so right. sorry, Chad. It took us a few nights to figure. Oh yeah, he started June 27th, and they've done it like 17 times, I believe. Does your mother enjoy it? Don't apologize to Chad. Apologize to the world. Yeah, I'm not the one doing this. I just feel bad for Chad. Especially what we, what we figured out. That's good to hear. Do you guys well, yeah, act this more makes like me mother and daughter, or do you guys depressing. act more like, you know, lovers? When, like, say you come home from, you know, the supermarket and you see Barbara, uh, would you say, hey, sweetheart, or do you say, hi, mom? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I haven't called her mom in quite some time now. Oh, really? So, yeah, I'm, I'm more of a calling her love at this point. But you recently yeah. started dating Fiona, isn't that that's true, right? In an open relationship? Yeah, yeah, it's it's, it's an, it, yeah, between Barbara and I it is an open relationship and I made that very clear with her. Right. Yes. Is Barbara dating anybody so, else? Well uh, no, <coughs> <she's not. coughs> no. But she's fine with you dating other people, right? Yeah, she's okay. Do you guys go on any dates or anything romantic like that? Well, I'll be, I'm not anything that oh, drive again, but we do, uh, as often as possible, eat at the dinner table together. Yeah. I haven't been able to much lately because I've had to switch to a soup diet because after getting the crown. Oh, I went to the oh did you? Yeah. Is Barbara dating anyone else? I don't know. I don't That's think true, Barbara yeah. is dating well, anyone else. Much like most open relationships, it's uh, one right. person so benefiting. Like yeah. That. Knowing, knowing you, Christine, I think that, uh, because you, I, I know, I understand that she's mature, you know, and she's mature and she's wise, she's wise in her ways, um, you know, she, she has, has experience and she loves you, and you yeah, have a great relationship, but wouldn't you want somebody who's younger? I, I didn't know if it was dementia or Alzheimer's. Yeah. 
a lot of time with your mom, like whatever you have left with her, that makes sense because you know you don't know how how long she has left. So you just wanna, you, you just don't want her to be lonely or anything, right? Yeah, obviously. But mm -hmm. yeah, I still uh, would. Want Literally a minute left at this point. Who is younger or close to my age? Obviously, I don't know, maybe. Um... You don't want anyone who's younger. Uh, not too many. Not too many others. Obviously, uh, with uh, my affirmations, I'm, I'm attracting my twin flame. Can we, we proceed towards it more slowly? Mm -hmm. Sorry, I'm playing the volume for my, I can't, I have a really bad ear because I just, I got sick, like you can't hear my voice. It's hard to hear anything at all, but I could hear you now. Go ahead. All right. So anyway, um, everything, with the events and everything and I was feeling like I really need a sexual release. Mm -hmm. and not too, many, not too many individuals on this side of the archer were coming up to the plate right, right, right there. So, and then the, everything was coming into good alignment. Yeah, I bet a lot of right? people weren't looking to fuck you, Chris. The signs were all there. Even Emmanuel, you know, God, just said, said it was okay. And towards God said this is okay? Yeah, then you don't have anything to worry about. If God himself said this is fine. Yeah. yeah. And uh, so, yeah. I gave a lot of stuff for myself. I was like, okay, so I'll take a dive for it, so... But how did this happen? How did this come about? Well, along which just mainly I was really, really horny, and I need uh, the true and honest uh, relationship to come about, so obviously this was one of the best ways to do it, despite it being with the... I'm I don't gonna want to fucking lady. kill <laughs> myself. <laughs> Take me out to the back of the shed. Shoot me in the I back know. of the head. Okay, so I think I yeah, that's the that's the full. Good. Ending. I'm glad that that's over. Oh, yeah. Never show this to me ever again. Thank you. Thanks. I, 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 I apologize. Smashing. I apologize. Wait. God. Fuck. Did it? Let's just walk there. I, I mean, at least we learned boys. something, right? Fucking sonatu necklace. Look. Luke Bob in the eye and went, I am on a mission from God. I mean, what God? <laughs> after that, I don't believe. <laughs> okay. That is, that is one of the worst destroyer. pieces of audio no, I have ever I listened to. I, I will admit computer. that. I couldn't handle it. <laughs> okay. Amy, come on. You have seen you have seen worse. Well, maybe not. No, I actually <laughs> genuinely stepped away from my computer. Oh Looking my contextually... This shit's pretty gnarly. It, it is pretty bad. I'm not gonna lie. That's I'm not gonna lie about that. Statement. <sighs> like it's not just the fact that salary. it's Chris Chan, but it's the fact that it's Chris Chan, and we know where it came from, and the fact that like shit doesn't pop off for nothing. This is a uh, uh, an admission of of not of guilt, perhaps, but it is an admission. I mean, it's definitely a he definitely uh, okay. In legal, I think in legal terms, this would definitely be at least an admission of guilt, though. On some level. Yeah, but the man don't feel guilty. Okay, true. The man don't feel no, guilty. he literally, he literally said. He literally said, said I was feeling like really horny, so I pulled a hentai move. <laughs> <laughs> That's literally yeah. what he said. Literally, his actual quote was, "Mainly, I was just really, really horny, and I was really feeling like I needed a sexual I mean, release." I mean, we all been there, but not been there enough to finger our moms. Sorry. I, and he said, I, I need a true and honest went... relationship to come about. Obviously, this is one of the best ways to do it. I just hate the fact that this, essentially, he tried to become a fucking hentai pro tag. This is, this is I mean, the that fucking is, worst. Does, does, that, does that sound like really anything truly crazy, considering it's Chris Chan? Like, when was the last time one of you seen a video with... Barb speaking in it. Look, I've never, I, didn't, I didn't know who Barb was before three hours ago. You need to watch a video of Barb, of Chris leading her of what to say into the camera, telling her that every, or telling her to tell the audience, his audience, that everything is fine. Everything is fine. Chris and shit, like, can I? This fucking happened. So, this is, this I is just the worst timeline. I, uh, I 
you know, this isn't that bad if you, if you, like, consider hentai, you know, shit, where, like, the son fucks his mother. And I'm like, yeah, but that shit stays in hentai, my guy. That does not transfer over to real Yeah, you, you definitely don't. Yeah. Don't make your fantasies real, people. You will be disappointed. And that's oh, that's, oh, okay. oh, that's oh, wait, what to take away from this podcast. <laughs> that's the that's second right. way. That's, that's the, the lesson. The, the, that's the lesson that. for this. No, why, no, no, is, yeah. uh, somebody why, asked, no, why is no one picking up on it? How does he know that? <laughs> <laughs> Do you know that? I mean, it's just <laughs> obvious. Yeah, Paul, how'd you know that? A lot of them are illegal, first of all. Um, so, I mean, not mine, that's not mine, of course. Not mine, of course, but other people's. Mm -hmm. Anyway. Paul's dream somebody. was to become a Nigerian child soldier. And his I'm dream really was to quick. Quick. First of all, to get off. first of all, it wasn't my, Shit. it wasn't Nigeria. It was a, I watched Blood Diamond as a kid, so it was whatever country Blood Diamond took oh place in. Oh my God, stop. What? I hate you so much. I was fucking choking. I've told one of you this before. I've told, I've tweeted me. about Blood no, Diamond being my favorite movie as a kid. He didn't tell me either. Oh, I tweeted about Blood Diamond and Ice Age 2 being my favorite movies when I was nine years old. Just Saving Captain Alex. <laughs> you know, I... This is gonna sound awful, but I, I, I would have rather had... I would, I would have rather seen this man get a Darwin Award than this. What the fuck? <laughs> Look, there's... And that, that's, that's fucking bad. Like, God. This is just... It's, it just... It it really couldn't be much oh, worse. You, don't don't jinx that, Lamb. Do not jinx that. That's, that's knowing everything else that Chris has said or don't, admitted to or don't, done. Lamb, don't... You dare say that. Do Look. not say those words because we've been <laughs> saying them for years and then this happened. Because he uh, fucking admitted to somebody, like someone coaxed it out of him I that mean, That he same would, girl like, also <laughs> convinced him to make a video. He considered having sex with a dog, but only if it was a collie because they're hot. It fucking excuse me. Oh, wait, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, we have to admit, if we're, if we're gonna ra rake, uh, rate dogs attractiveness, a collie is pretty up there. Siberian Shut Husky- Shut up! <laughs> you stupid motherfucker! God damn it! I hate you so much. Wait, wait, no. But like, seriously, like, if you if we're gonna talk about dogs, like, it has to be like Siberian Husky somewhere up there. Kali is definitely in the top I, ten. I, I, and those little white. Dogs. I mean, thank you. I'm calling on you to bully him. The fuck ability of dogs. I'm not. I'm just saying, I'm not, like, if if dogs I'm were rating dead. themselves I'm, on the track. I'm not joining this conversation. <laughs> can we just bully him now? Is that a, is that a thing we can I'm do? Not, I'm, I'm not. We I'm always like, bullied him when yeah, yeah, the podcast. Is, usually, it's when the podcast is ending. But you know, we can start early i'm down for that who's a, who's a good submissive and beatable boy oh my god okay. thanks Cod okay let's let's just take... not ranting I wouldn't so anyway ranting. the most attractive talk is <laughs> oh my god <laughs> i'm just saying if, you, thing, if dogs were to have a competition if this, dogs this were to have a competition that, among themselves out of everything would... that has currently happened do you think that the prison arc, or not the prison, the, the trial arc will be very big? Mm, I don't know if it will go to trial because Chris is severely mentally unwell. I think basically if he gets put in front of uh, the shrinks that give him his psych psychiatric evaluation, they're going to go to the courts and the prosecutors and go, yeah, this guy's like, it's not happening in the head. Yeah, <laughs> like, stand this trial. Guy's gone. Yeah, he was sitting talking about an entire universe, and there's going to be a merging and like sonitude and shit like that. Yeah, this guy. Yeah, the, don't don't bother taking it to trial. This guy is fried in the fucking head. God, we we joke about people being internet poisoned, but that is like this is that is, this the is more of an internet, internet poison. poison. He fuck. has become the internet yeah. poison. Like, yeah. let's let's count the things wrong, right? Got an ego trip off of the Sega contest. Was it a Sega contest or was it a Pokemon contest? Like, I keep hearing. It was Pokemon. When he was he a boy. Like, yeah, he won. I think it was Pokemon stuff. He was he won. like, it was like eight when he was a boy. It, it goes from like that to people trolling him for years, and just the internet slowly feeding this man what is essentially just mental cyanide it's, it's only a tiny community that still do it like the shit with chris chan got that bad that even kiwi farms and 4chan both said Fuck enough this. is enough enough this is, is, this is enough. too much yeah and the only people that still did it are like a small community of like, see how, like yeah yeah see how like the really malicious people mm. like the really is, horrible ones we're talking yeah, blue, ones blue spike level and up where like they pretended to be a girl and then was like i'm gonna tell on you 
that you committed like, this is, pedophilia, you know. Like, this is literally Drakenlord, but, like, times a million. What the fuck? I have never Dragon heard Lord about Drakenlord, like, and you've brought him up, like, Some semblance of sense left in him to not be, you know, completely enamored. Yeah, no, well, the, the Chris Chan at least has the excuse that he's severely mentally unwell. Dragonlord's just an idiot. He's just Dragon just a complete at, idiot, yeah. but at least he has a sense yeah. of, yeah, I'm not completely poisoned. This is like stacking mental illness on top of all that. It's not even like, at, at this point, I can't even say it's entirely oh. his fault for most of the arcs. People, most of the arcs was him getting fucking trolled. This, however... Yeah. Oh boy. Oh wait, wait. people this, are putting together the, the money. The problem with this is can. nobody can tell if it's fact or fiction. First of all, if it's fiction, I mean, what the fuck? Still, but wait, wait, guys, it's better people, than the people are putting together money if for this Chris is fiction, right now. It is probably the most well planned out, uh, best uh, executed fiction like, in a very long time Christ. to make it trend this hard. Like, I really hope it's. I fiction. really I, hope. Yeah, I really no, they're hope trying to cover for be. his. Uh, what's it called? You're trying Thanks, to call. I'm saying here, and I'm and I'm not, I'm not asking you to do it, but I'm saying at least someone, someone will, in the near future, ask you to do a video on him, because People of already, all this. God. People already have. Yeah, they're, they're, gonna pay, they're gonna pay for, seen, for him a place to stay. Play, and, I'm um, saying they're gonna bother you about fees. it. Yeah, I know. Like, I've always this. refused because I don't want to get the hype train up on Chris crazy. again and attract. Basically, I yeah. don't want to. I don't want to attract. Wang also said fuck no to this, yeah, yeah, and I don't I'm blame not, him. Yeah. Because holy fuck, this is all. This isn't even like entertaining funny. Like that was I'm maybe the first three hear arcs. Joke about it, but we can't do it on his own channel. <laughs> but no, no. Here's the thing. Like it's it's fucked up to the point where it's like you know the first three arcs are like all right, that's fucked. That's kind of funny. You know, the, like mm. this managed to happen. But at this that's... point, it's just like okay, come on. Oh. I haven't even <laughs> laughed about it yet because I'm still in shock. Chris, Chris Chan is if Live Leak was a person. Like, you watch it and you hate and are disgusted by everything you that you see. Look you away. click right on the next video anyway. Like, like that's that's just what it is. It's a car crash. People like a fucking... That's, well, that's not a car crash. Like I said, this is the this internet. This is a 20 car pileup. No, that Chris it's Chan is the right? internet 9-11. That's, yeah. what, that's what he is, yeah. Because everyone's going to spread the videos around. Everyone's going to talk about it to no end. I agree to do a podcast faster. <laughs> God. Yes, absolutely. I will talk Chris Chan with you. What has he done today? Oh, fuck. No, I was not signed up for that. God. I mean, in a way, you were. In a way, you, <sighs> you know, the worst part it. is I woke up this morning thinking, oh, you know, I'm going to start my diet tomorrow. I'm going to get ready. I'm just going to hang out in my room. Maybe play. Oh, there went Poe. <laughs> it's like, hey, I'm going to play some games today. And then this happens. What the fuck? It's unfortunate. It truly is. Oh, I am murdering my timeline with all the shit posts. Is that fucking Gino <laughs> Samuel? Wait, Gino Samuels? He, he, what did he tweet? No, no, someone posted a picture of him, but I don't know if that's like a picture that was taken oh, like okay. today. <sighs> I mean, it oh, looks kind of like him, so I'm assuming, but... All we have to accept is that... At least Chris Chan can't top this. Can he? Do you think he could? Don't. Don't say that. He, no, what can he find a way? Reasonably, he'll, what could he do? He actually open up a fucking void into his other world and set his creatures upon us. You just wait. See, I'm it afraid could get to... more wild. I, I must admit, I'm Hispanic, so I am completely superstitious. Do not jinx that. Okay, that fine. Is, I will not, I that will is not a curse. jinx Chris Chan. Because we, we've been, like I said, we've been saying for years... Ah, he can't top what he's already done so far. Ah, he, he's already drying out. He's washed. And then this happened. I really but... did. I thought the shit was done, and we were just going to look at him, you know, causing havoc in a... In a... We were just going to... Everyone a... thought it was like, oh, this is just kind of like a... What's it called? Like a case study of, oh, you know, this is what happens when you're completely internet poisoned. And then they took it to this level, and you're just like, nope, okay, I'm not touching this. Gee. It's a good point. It's a good point. Got it. Thank uh, you, thank you for saying that, Nick. Anyway, uh, he's just uh, singing me right now. Thank you. Any any last points? I think we should about close it up today. Uh, no, I I don't have anything further to say on the subject <laughs> apart from like I hope the police investigate it. You and hope it's fake. I I, I I hope that it is just a, another delusion that Chris is having. Um, but if it turns out that it's true, then like Chris just needs to be put in a psych ward. For yeah, the rest he's of his he's life. definitely not going to go to yeah. jail for this. He's not going to go to jail. They will yeah, not put him like in jail. He needs to go. To a but psych he needs ward. help. He, he, he needed put in a psych ward ten years ago. 
This I... is way yeah. late. Yeah, anyway. I don't. I I don't think there's any coming back. Chris was left to his own delusions for far too long. Like social services should have been crawling all over him and his family around 2009, but they weren't for some reason. They just left them and they. I can tell. You, I can tell you exactly why. Because they're uh, fucking incompetent sometimes. That's beyond incompetence, my man. That's like gross negligence at this point. The state could get in trouble for I mean, this for when not literally intervening sooner. Knew, when literally everyone knew about about Christian, like yeah, you can't tell like we me, knew. you can't tell me that some social workers who lived in Virginia didn't see that, didn't know about him. Yeah, like there were so many things that maybe they like, should have been done role or something. And I feel like people have been called over this. People, they just, they started ignoring it. And that's the issue. People, after a while, got so sick of the calls, so sick of, like, hearing about Chris Chen, that even the help that he should have gotten just started ignoring it because they were sick of it. Yeah. Because it's not that's like people haven't prospect. tried to give him help either. And that's the other side of this coin, is that there weren't just monsters working with Chris. There were people out there that actually, like, tried to talk sense into him for months, years at a time. Uh, Vivian G was one. Um, yeah. uh, the captain, I think, it was his name. I don't know who, what relation this man has to Chris, but I guess was like looking out for him uh, and counseling him after the try try guys or whatever. Like there has been, and th the amount of money that the man gets for things that he does, like we're talking, uh, he adopts animals. Like, he takes in animals from the backyard, strays and shit, that they can't afford because of tugboat is limited, which his monthly tugboat, for anybody that doesn't know this, is is the money that he receives, like, uh, like social security or, like, disability or whatever. This is the money he gets, other than, uh, or they get, other than, like, maybe putting together medallions or something or cr doing comics. Fuck even knows anymore. But... There's been like paper trails. There's been document a, a, a documentation of all this shit. He is literally the most documented person, or at least to my knowledge, the most documented person in, in human world. history. That's fucking wild, they and nothing's been done about it. Documentation on Christian? They do Hitler? Yes. For real? For real. I, I'm completely for real. That is a thing, and that is just—it's mortifying that after. All that documentation, after all the knowledge we have, after all the insider knowledge we have, nothing's been properly done. I think people have tried, and I will not fall on this not trying. All, all we have to say about this, like just Chris Chan, what for better or worse will be immortalized throughout history. Whether that's fortunate or unfortunate, depends I mean, on that's your point of view. I'm pretty sure it's unfortunate. If you're infamous, he, it, it's it's definitely unfortunate. Thank you. Thank I mean, you. it's not like he murdered millions of people like Genghis Khan, who has been immortalized. I mean, yeah, Genghis Khan's name it's will be just... immortalized, but who really knows that much about Genghis Khan? Like, bruh, this is like, they have documented Chris Chan so well, they could be a part, like, they, they should hire them as part of, like, the NSA or some shit. This is like... Literally, the autists have been documenting him better than the FBI, I'm sure, have documented anybody else of any significance. I mean, that's kind because of... Because they are autists. They are just on you... top of the shit. Ten bucks that the people who documented Chris Chan could easily document any mass shooter and get them arrested. Yeah. And that's here's the question, though. The, the question isn't if they can, it's will they. After all this, the question will always yeah. be will they do it. Oh, hell no. Nobody would do that. Anyway, problem. thank you guys all for being here. Thank you, Dankula. Thank you, Lamb, oh, for showing sorry. up short notice. Thank you, Amy, no. for Absolutely. hopping Mad in. Lab, Chris Chan, when? And thank you, <laughs> Baku, for getting me off my ass and making me start the podcast again. I, I had to hey. do it to you. Yeah. This Can't was a... wait for another episode of this degeneracy. This, hopefully, we'll be, we'll be doing something with Sweeney on Sunday, Sunday morning. I'm if going back into it. hibernation for another 30 years. Wake oh, me up, Oh, Lamb, come on. How about next week? <laughs> I'll discuss my contract with you after cast. Thank you. God. Good night, everybody. This is a great podcast. Good night. Take care, everyone.